Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how to do simple avatar masking on CapKit only. I tried to make it as simple as possible for you guys to understand three. I made an avatar masking tutorial before but it was a bit complicated for some of you guys so I made this one instead. I hope this one turns out less complicated. Anyways, let's get started. So this is what we're trying to create. Let's get started. First, get your clip ready. You're gonna export your clip and make a new project using the clip you just exported. Find cutout then press on customized cutout. For this part, you're gonna need to color in your avatar to remove the background. I'm going to speed this up a little bit. By a little bit, I mean a lot. It took me so much time to do this all because of my shaky hand. And done. The background should have been cleared by now. Now you're going to press on overlay and add an overlay which I'm going to show you right now. Screenshot this. Now zoom in the overlay. Go to blend and press on darken. You can adjust the overlay too, whatever you like. Go to adjust and copy these settings. After you're done with that, go to Filter, press on Robust and make it 100. Export it, then go back to the main video. Go to Overlay and add the video you just exported. Go to Blend and press on Lighten. Adjust the clip. Press on the main video and copy it. Then move it to an overlay. Now go to Cutout then Customize, Cutout, and do the same thing we did before. Make the brush any size you're more comfortable with and start coloring in the avatar. I'm going to speed this up again, here. And done. Now we're so close to finishing. Okay, so now press on the dotted overlay, then go to mask. Choose the split one and make it fade out like what I did. So this one is optional. Press on the main clip, go to filter and press on robust. It just makes it look better. Now go to the dotted overlay and to filter again. You can choose any filter here, since the one I chose might not suit your clip. I chose the plum filter. And we're done. You can export your video now and show it off to everyone. You can add many other effects and overlays to make it look better. For example, here I added one more overlay and some effects. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you understood this tutorial and want another one, then comment down below what the next tutorial should be about. Also, make sure to subscribe and like the video so I can get more motivation for making more videos like this.
Anyways, bye-bye. Have a nice day.